Have you seen the tight response times in our new service level agreements? We need to get our transaction response times down and keep them down. But we're getting pretty good throughput in our systems. Not throughput, response times. We need each transaction to take less time from start to finish. Microseconds really matter here. We should use the Oracle Times 10 in-memory database. We can't just tune our existing database? Tuning works well for many of our applications, but these tight response time SLAs need something more. Times 10 is a relational database with a standard SQL interface. It stores all its data in main memory, so network latency and disk IOs are eliminated, and response times are much faster. Show me how. A conventional disk-based relational database runs on a separate server from the application and is optimized for disk access. Typically, applications connect to the database from a client machine over the network and the database accesses the data stored on disk. Times 10, on the other hand, stores the entire database in main memory. It could run the database in the same server or even the same process with the application, so there's no network or disk overload. We can get faster response time for the SQL operations because we're just accessing main memory on one machine. But is it predictable? It's more predictable. By storing data in memory right next to the application itself, we don't have to worry about network speeds, traffic congestion, and disk IOs. See how the response time and predictability of this real application improved with times 10? OK, but what happens to all that data in memory when the server goes down? Nothing is lost because while Times 10 uses RAM to store the database at runtime, the entire database and the transaction logs are persisted to disk. If the server goes down, the database is recovered from disk. Plus, we can guard against any application downtime by running Times 10 replication. We can fail over to a standby database without any application downtime. Sounds great, but does it work for my existing applications or do we have to develop something new? Both. We can build Times 10 into our new applications, and we can also use it as a cache to accelerate our existing Oracle database applications. See how this complex real-time application has much faster response times. That's like 10 times faster. So that's why it's called Times 10. But how tough is this to deploy? Times 10 is standards compliant across the board, and it is compatible with the Oracle database. So we preserve our investment in existing code, and our developers can use their current skills. Might just work. It will work. When you need real-time access to the application data and very fast response time, Oracle Times 10 in-memory database is the best solution.